Good morning. Let's uh, do talk about one very important topic that is uh, consolidate option in Calc software. Right now, uh, the consolidate option is basically used to get data from one or more different worksheets and then apply some function into it. Like you want to find some of uh, different data values present in different sheets, so you can get the data from different sheet, apply a sum function or an average function, and then you want to show the result on a separate sheet, a separate final sheet. That can be done with the help of the consolidated option. So let me share my screen. Now, uh, consolidation allows you to gather together your data from separate worksheets into a master worksheet, right? Now, how we actually do it, for doing this, the option lies in the data tab of the Calc software. And here you can see, here is the consolidate. And when you click on this option, you will see a dialog box like this. Now here, we have the first option is what function you want to apply. For example, if I want the sum of all the values from different functions, so I'll select sum. Now we have other functions also. You can also apply average, you can apply count, you can find maximum, you can find minimum, plus there are many other. So you have to select a function from here. It's a drop down list, let's click on this arrow and if your list will come, you just have to click on the choose the option that you want. Then here, you have to add up the ranges of the data that you want to, from where you want to use the value. Now, how we are going to add this? For this, first, uh, second thing is you have to use this option, source data range. From here, you have to select from where you are going to pick the data. Now, let's say we have the data in sheet one, from cell number F1, 2, T3. So we can pick, we can simply type this or we can select that portion. This particular thing will automatically come and then click on add button. When you add here, then that particular record will be added here in the, in the consolidate ranges of. Then go to the second sheet, again select the area where the numbers or the values are, right? This particular range will come here, click on add button, that also will be added. Likewise, you can go through multiple sheet, sheets and select the range here that you want, where your actual values are, from where you want to pick the values and then put a function to that value. So keep on adding, so you'll see all side of ranges will be added here, will be displayed here. Then finally, we have this particular area where you want to show the result. Now for this, click on this option, go to the sheet where you want to find show the final answer. So select that particular cell from where the answer should come. And uh, the moment you select it, that cell number is, uh, cell location will be shown here. Like it is sheet one, A10, right? And then just click on OK button and your values will be copied, not copied, will be picked up from that particular sheet, the ranges that we have given here. And the function will be applied, like sum we have selected, the values will be added together. And finally, the answer will be shown here in this particular case. Right? Now let me go to Calc software and show you exactly how exactly it happens. Now let's say we have sheet one. If you see here, sheet one, here, bottom. We have marks of a student or in English, right? These are some of the marks by the student in English. And to go to sheet two, these are some of the marks stored in maths by a student. Now I want the sum of both English and maths marks and that should come to sheet number three. Let's go to sheet three. I want the total here, right? Now the total is already shown. Let me remove this first. Let's make it black. So I want the sum of marks here. I want the total of English like 21 plus 23 should come here in C3. Similarly, similarly, 34 plus 56 
should come to the next cell. Likewise, 15 plus 45 should come to the third cell. So consequently, all the values from sheet 1 from this to this range should be added to all the values in sheet 2 from this to this range and should be shown here in this particular location. Now, how we are going to do this? Let's go to the consolidate option. The consolidate option lies in the data tab. Here you can see the consolidate option. Click on this. A dialog box will open up like this. Now, uh, first of all, we need to select the function that you want to apply. You can find sum, you can find count, you can find average, max, mean, product, numbers. There are other options also. So let's go with sum. Right? There's some data here. Let me remove this. So now the data ranges are blank. First, go select the source data range. Source data range means from where you want to pick the value. This is the source data range. Click on this option. Now go to sheet one and select this range. The moment you select, you will see the range will be shown here automatically. You just have to click on add button. So this range will be added here. Now let's go to sheet two, remove this first. Let's go to sheet two. Now in sheet two, you want to use these values, select all these values here. You will see sheet two, G3 to G7 will be here. Just click on add, but this range is also added. Likewise, if you have more number of sheets, you can select those values, those uh, ranges, the data share ranges, cell ranges will be added here automatically one by one. So once you have once you're done with this, then just go, go to the last option which shows that copy results to. So where do you want the results to come? Let me remove this first again. Now I want the result to be on sheet number three, let's say, in this step in cell number A3. So click on this A3 and the range and the sheet number will come automatically. That's it. Nothing else could be done. Just click on OK button. Now you'll see the sums are made automatically. Right? So this 44 is the sum of 21 of sheet 1 and 23 of sheet 2. Similarly, 90 is the answer for Second value that is 34 from sheet 1 and 56 from sheet 2. Likewise, these are all different totals of different cells from the ranges that we have given. So, this is all about consolidated option. So, I hope this is clear to you all. Kindly practice it at the home at least once. And uh, in case you find uh, any kind of difficulty, you need any kind of help, you can discuss this later on. You can touch me anytime. Thanks a lot.